Huh. Herein lies the bodies of fortunate souls of Zay Paveglia. Wow. So... I'm guessing we have an objective in here somewhere. Just a very large pla- ow. Oops, that's not what I wanted to press. Ow! You know what I should know? What I should do is I should go... Put my sunglasses. There we go. There we go. Now I can harm him. <sighs> I don't appreciate there being a wisp there. Oh god, hand. So yeah, melee is stronger than... and the range. Ow. No, I cannot hurt the hand. So, like, what is our objective here? Well, I made it to the top. Do I... get an objective now? Okay, what... Where's our quest log? No, really, how do I view the side quests? I don't know. Give me that. Nom. I guess that tombstone's not horrible. Oh, we're gonna be rotating this place. Oh boy. Oh hey, at least I can run so I can jump down here. So I'm gonna guess this side is the entrance I need to get to my objective. So I need to look around to see if I can figure out how to rotate this place. It seriously stop ow. His hands are annoying. Go away. Do you like not? Alright. I wonder if I could bottle one of their bones. No. Goddamn hand. Give me these coins. Oh, 
Yay. Looks like something going on here. And all wandering souls gather in this place. Their curse will be bro Oh. Oh. I figured it out. There we go. There we go. There's the next soul. No! Wrong button, there we go. It probably best to go this way. Give me that. Down I go. Take that. Anything on this wall? No. Keep going up. Seriously, this looks like it'd be something. It is. Wow. Wow. I will definitely take the heals. Give me that. Kill this stuff. Now I've collected all four of the souls I've defeated. And wait, that's just healing. Don't need that right now. What the fuck? Give me that. Oh boy. And... Ow. Get out of here. Now I gotta figure out how to get both these souls back up. Yeah, I can't jump high enough to grab onto that. Here we go. Take a soul. Gotta come back over here, grab the yellow. Now we can bring it back up. And done. Thank you, stranger. Our souls could rest once again. However, our king is still being controlled by an evil being. Please help us defeat it. So, they're gonna... Have stop being restless by just destroying themselves. Got it. Yay! 
Is this the boss chamber? Yep. Hello, Durgan. Coast had the Minted Dragon King. Well... Oh, it's gonna be a bouncy. Ah, I didn't even notice the hand was happening. Oh, yeah. Oh, that was a miss. Oh, yeah. There we go. So honestly. Plus one defense. Go, oh, go. Oh, you lose an attack when wearing that. Let's just up my defense. Here we go. Oh, that... Probably not supposed to happen. There we go. Stop with the hand. Bam. Now you like that, I hit your hand. Oh. Gotcha. Oh my god. There we go. Bam! Guessing you have to hit six times since because of the six souls. Or, you know, only the four. Oh, hey there, Koala King. Thank you for rescuing us, citizen. In the old world, it was once, but. There was but one large continent. I ruled over a peaceful kingdom. But after the cataclysm, our civilization died out. They remained this dimension as spirits. It has made us so very happy to continue living in our kingdom even after death. Now, thanks to you, we will continue to exist peacefully. Please come to my castle that I may repay your kindness. For now, goodbye. Yay. Grab this chest. We now have legendary treasure number two. Temporal ring. Hooray. Here we go. I have a feeling I missed something here. Yep. Golden Carrot. Max health increase plus one. So... Hmm. Yeah, I don't know where he wants me to go. Guess I'll just have to look for him. Oh, you're back to life because your curse wasn't broken. Well, I guess we can go tell the hag that we saved the king. What's in this direction though? I've never been this direction. Oh, it's there's green. 
Just like, let me on this platform. There we go. Oh! Got another page from Bagus's journal. This is truly a incredible discovery. Peers, we have found the remains of this ancient city of Paveglia. We have a guide here by the old lighthouse. Don't ask me how it is still working. I can't explain. This was once the home of the people who are responsible for stopping the Great War and the birthplace of the hero Hawaiian. And more believable is the floating graveyard that hangs precariously above the island. Yes, it's true. A massive piece of earth seemingly aloft by magic itself. Well... Oh, I can't go... Oh, right... Uh, you know what? I can go up here! Yeah! Oh, there's nothing up here. I'm just wasting everyone's time. Alright. Oh, you died! Honestly, you couldn't even stay alive while I was gone. Get our ghost, too? I am a spirit, yes. Thank you both for what you've done for the city of Paveglia. I've been protecting this island for countless years. Once a great kingdom populated by humans and animals, protected magic and studied science. The city was finding force of the old world, a time when the two philosophies were at odds with each other. But after the great cataclysm, when the world broke at the islands, the city settled here. A large mass of earth that hangs above the islands is about to climb with us, causing even more devastation. However, the citizens were able to hold in place long enough to cast a powerful spell. Been floating there in the sky ever since. Those who survived tried to carry on their lives in this newly formed island. The climate was too harsh and desolate for humans or animals to survive. Many have left for warmer climates, while others, like myself, were too stubborn to leave. So many of us pa asked that we began using the floating orb as a graveyard. That is how it became the catacombs that it is today. Well, and this is just the same shit. I see. Well then. I think we're done with Paveglia. Oh, hey there. That goes. Arts, you should go visit castle when you have a chance. He has a great party back there in the old world. King Boone still lives there, I'm sure he'd love to have company. You know where the castle is, right? Just east of here, past the bridge. Oh. Uh, yeah, problem. Bridge is not functional. Alright. Oh. Mitch is, re is reopened the jail store back there. You can find anything you want in there. Towards a little limited now, but yes, something if you'd like. And what do you think he has? Oh, it's a mouse. Honor, if you save me by cell, I'd like to offer you a special one time deal on this once popular item. The old world humans would wear this mask when they wanted to go unnoticed by uh, less friendly animals. Not everyone was as tolerant as since Paveglia City, you know. So what do you say, interested? Yay! Broad and animal masks. Guys, just open the animal. Congrats. Who knows, maybe this will make it... it easier to try and... help out the tree. Oh, hello there, 
actual human ghost. Did you know the great hero whale was from this city? He came as a year as a youth and studied magic, even though his family was against it. When the demon came to destroy the world, he set on a quest to stop it. He's a true hero and I'm proud to have known him. Yay. Heroes. You. Beetle. When we were alive, Midge and I ran a very successful jail store. Those were good days. It took me a long time to accept my old life was gone. Midge, on the other hand, won't give up his dream of running the ass smart. What's he thinking? We haven't had a customer in a hundred years. I just bought this mouse from him. See, but Vaglia was once a haven for the peaceful humans and animals of the world. We accepted those who practiced magic as well as those who studied science. Animals and humans now segregate themselves and are afraid of each other. It's really a shame. I see you two are quite close. Makes me happy to see that. Hey, Peep and I are not that close. We just have to have common goals, that's all. Sure, if you say so. See this old lighthouse? My dad told me it was, it was lit during the night. Its beacon shines to the horizon. You could sail to that point and dive to the ocean floor. You'd find a sunken treasure. Always wanted to see if that was true. If only I could go diving. Okay, so lighting the lighthouse is just step one of its quest. Ha! Fuck you, ice slimes. Nope. Uh, what? There we go. Just gotta use the f oh the bobbing of the ice to to your advantage. Got to throw it when it's low, and it'll rise the slime up into your her hook. All right. Um. Hi. Why? Why do you block me like this? Oh boy... Uh... I guess I'll come up here. Is there any way to... Nah, the bridge is solid from the side. Yeah, there's not much I can do about that tentacle. I guess I have to go back to the left. Which is unfortunate. You know. I mean, you can definitely still see the beam of light hey, during the day. Yeah. Basically, like, yeah, dive down right here. But I don't have the ability to go diving yet. Alright. Great, it's just gonna be a long ways to travel all the way back. But you know what, I can probably do this island now. Yep. Yeah. All right. How would I get the fire up here, though?
Oh! It goes through floors. Oh, there's another torch. Not that floor. Oh, there's a ceiling here. Oh, it's not a very long ceiling. Okay. This definitely requires the flashlight and the ball to work together. Uh, oh. Next obstacle is right there. There we go. And we get a new nav pearl. Another legendary treasure, great. Head back out onto the seas. And yep, that was a big spot. Ah, uh, god, I really need to be paying better attention for those. Well, you know what? I think I've played enough for today. So next time on Treasure Adventure World... Probably gonna be heading back to... Uncle... Haggins, was it? Keep forgetting his name. Uncle Bagus, gonna s see what our new who treasure can unlock for us. Oh boy! Well, I have over half the specimens. And I have, oh, I still need several more house items. I swear if that's just the protectorate flower from Starbound. Oh well, I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.